I'm leaving you, Neil. We can't go on with this sham. Look at us. At this. Eating in silence. Might as well be in separate rooms. Like the rest of our life. Together but apart. When I think of your so-called friends bleating on about retirement. As if it's the only thing to look forward to in life. All that time together. Getting closer. <laughs> to death, perhaps. The way I've lived my life. Feeling you stare at me at the corner of your eye with that resentment. And your other women. That bloody euphemism working late. As you'd strut through the door with that self-satisfied grin on your face. Sometimes you'd even throw me the odd wink. You know, I didn't care. I wanted you to fuck other women. At least if you've got your fix. We didn't have to endure a night together. I've dreamt of leaving. But I've never had the energy to go. You've sucked the life out of me. Whilst I willingly let you. Perhaps if you'd just hit me now and then, might have spurred me on to leave. But it seems even to touch me now. It's too much effort. This house, like living in a mausoleum. Are we stuck together through our grief? You're not a bad man. And you're not even a half decent one. And I'm no better. Wanting to hold on to a memory. So... Now I've thought about how many good years I might have left. I know I've got to go. Otherwise we'll be doomed to repeat this fucking cycle. I don't love you, Neil. I don't even like you. You say something? <laughs>